the left heart and look. It's our second last system, okay? Okay, sir. In endocrinology, we will discuss the drugs related with pituitary. Drugs related with thyroid. Drugs related with adrenal. Drugs related with pancreas. And two drugs in last, drugs related with reproductive system. Okay? Or reproductive glands like ovary and It according to the disease, okay? Which system, which hormone, low or high? We use it well. Okay, now let's start from the two, three. What are the problem related with the two, three? The two, three hormone, they're producing, two, three hormone produce growth hormone, pituitary hormone produce growth, lectin hormone, pituitary hormone produce thyroid, stimulating hormone, pituitary hormone produce A, C, C, H, adrenocorticotrophic, releasing hormone, okay? Growth hormone, prolactin, thyroid stimulating hormone, and adrenocortico, trophic releasing hormone. So these hormones, the other the, from the posterior pituitary, the clinical point of view from posterior pituitary, we're having two hormones, one ADH and one oxytocin. The condition, the pathological condition related with, important related with growth hormone, also related with prolactin, and one hormone here on the left, Pituitary release, LH, also release, etc. Okay. And these hormone under control of hypo. Hypothalamus release, what hypothalamus release here? Growth hormone, inhibitory hormone, growth hormone, releasing hormone. Hypothalamus release. Prolactin in every hormone to control prolactin. Okay? Hypothalamus release GNRH, conidotrophin releasing hormone acts on LH and FSH secreting cell. Hypothalamus release thyroid releasing hormone. Hypothalamus release corticotrophin releasing hormone. So these hormones you can see here act on growth hormone, these two hormones. Okay? Act on growth hormone, prolactin hypty hormone acts on prolactin, gonadotrophin releasing hormone acts on LS and FSH to control their secretion, and TRH control the secretion of TSH. TRH control the secretion of ACTH. Clear? So this hormone is released by hypothalamus and hypothalamus and pituitary. The posterior pituitary hormone actually they are produced from hypothalamus stored in pituitary, then they directly come. Okay. So these hormones they just store inside the pituitary. They're not produced by pituitary oxytocin and ADH. Oxytocin and ADH. The disease is related with the pituitary first one here. Growth hormone also. Prolactin also, they are so important, okay? So related with the growth hormone, the two pathological conditions related with the growth hormone, number one, acromegaly. Acro. Okay. Another, you can do that. So in these two conditions, growth hormone is very high. An opposite condition happen 
the growth hormone low if growth hormone low it leads to dwarfism dwarfism is a short picture okay dwarfism is a short picture in dwarfism growth hormone level may be less here growth hormone very high necromegaly and gigantism so if growth hormone in excess it can cause acromegaly and gigantism if growth hormone in excess how what we can do for this patient so excess of growth hormone is also it's not good thing eh yeah? so acromegaly and gigantism Let's start. Sorry for interrupting. Okay, you guys can restart the meeting. Just three minutes left. Okay. Restart the meeting. Okay, sir. Restart.